one minute of quick fire questions. Each correct answer is worth a thousand pounds. You ready? Yep. Your time starts now. What nationality was the writer Hans Christian Andersen? Danish. Correct. Which capital city hosted the first modern Olympic Games in 1996? Athens. Correct. What is the largest species of shark? Uh, the whale shark. Correct. How many years bad luck are you traditionally said to get if you break a mirror? Seven. Correct. How many chains are there in a furlong? Eight. It's ten. What are mohawk, mullet and Rachel types of? Haircuts. Correct. The, in ancient Greece, what took place in the Hippodrome? Uh, horse racing. Correct. Used when cooking pasta, which culinary term means to the tooth in Italian? Al dente. Correct. Which British composer wrote the operas Billy Budd and Peter Grimes? Elgar. Britain. In the Bible, Adam and Eve were expelled from which garden? Eden. Correct. The only brother in which family of writers was called Branwell? Bronte. Correct. Benjamin Netanyahu became which country's prime minister for the second time? Israel. Tournament? Correct. What is the seventh of the Ten Commandments? Thou shalt not commit adultery. Correct. What name is shared by a crop jacket and a dance made famous by Torval and Dean? Valero. Correct. Uh, Ponta del Garda is the capital of which Atlantic island group? The, the answer for that was the Azores. You answered... 12 questions correctly, that is £12,000. You've got to be happy with that? Yeah, pretty happy with that, yeah. Yeah, very happy. I was looking for eight, so uh, yeah. 12 is much better than I could hope for. Yeah, fantastic. Good luck. Thank you. Build up as much money as you can. Les, your time starts now. Harpy, bald and golden are species of what bird? Eagle. Correct. What type of pastry is traditionally used to make eclairs and profiteroles? Shoot. Correct. Madonna divorced which film director in 2008? Gary. Correct. Salisbury is in which English county? Wiltshire. Correct. Which late BBC DJ was born John Ravenscroft? Uh, John Peel. Correct. What's the chemical symbol for tin? SN. Correct. Satnav is an abbreviation of what two words? Satellite navigation. Correct. Which US president gave the Gettysburg Address? Lincoln. Correct. What film features Terry Jones saying he's not the Messiah, he's a very naughty boy? Luther Bryan. Correct. Which diarist ended many of his entries with and so to bed? Correct. What country won this year's Six Nations Rugby Tournament? Uh, France. Correct. What planet is known as the sister planet to Earth? Venus. Correct. What Tennessee Williams play features the character of Blanche Dubois? Street uh, Sunset Buddha. No, no, no. Pass. Oh, streetcar named Desire. No, Who played Rowdy Yates in Rawhide? Clint Eastwood. Correct. How many legs does a hexapod have? Six. Correct. Cura Bell was a pen name used by which of the Bronte sisters? Anne. No, Charlotte Bronte. Oh, that was extraordinary. 14 answers correct. £14,000. Wow. Brilliant. Well played you, Liz. <laughs> Got to keep it now. <laughs> Precisely. You have one minute to build up as much money as you can. OK. Your time starts now. Complete the well-known rhyme. Red Sky at Night, Shepherds... Delight. Correct. Teriyaki is a cooking technique that originated in which country? Japan. Correct. Which Welsh city lies at the mouth of the River Taff? Cardiff. Correct. Who is fourth in line to the British throne? Andrew. Correct. Which cathedral is the seat of the primate of the Church of England? Uh, Canterbury. Cathedral. Correct. Who replaced David Coleman as the regular host of A Question of Sport? Uh, Sue Barker. Correct. Which band created the rock opera Tommy? The Who. Correct. Who was British Prime Minister from 1990 to 1997? Uh, John Major. Correct. Which South American river features in the title of a number one song by Enya? Orinoco. Correct. Douglas is the capital of which crown dependency? Isle of Man. Correct. Woodhouse is the surname of which Jane Austen heroine? Uh, pass. Emma, in law, what do the letters QC stand for? Queen's Council. Correct. Errol Brown was the lead singer of which group? Hot Chocolate. Correct. Rose Gray and Ruth Rogers family. Time is up. You got 12, right? That's £12,000. That was fantastic. Not bad. Build up as much cash as you can. All right, good luck. Your time starts now. Which neighbour's character married Scott Robinson? Uh, Charlie. Correct. What gambling game comes from the French for little wheel? Uh, roulette. Correct. What reptile is used to describe fake tears? Crocodile. Correct. What was the pen name of American writer Truman Streckfuss Persons? Pass. Truman Capote. What's the longest mountain range in the world? Uh, the Andes. Correct. Futons are padded mattresses originating from which country? Japan. Correct. Which Australian singer had a top ten hit with Sweet About Me? Uh, Gabriella Chilmi. Yeah, correct. The name of what type of coffee drink is Italian for milk? Latte. Correct. Which British playwright wrote Look Back in Anger? John Osborne. Correct. Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and Museum is in which Scottish city? Glasgow. Correct. Which US Civil War general was nicknamed Stonewall? Uh, Jackson. Correct. 
White Men Can't Jump is a film about what sport? Basketball. Correct. Who did Andrew Motion succeed as Poet Laureate? Uh, Ted Hughes. Correct. What type of weapon is a scimitar? A sword. You were right, but just out of time. Are you sure you lay bricks? <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> 12 right is £12,000. <laughs> Fantastic. Well, you know how this game works. Oh, yes. Good luck. Let's build up some money. OK. Your time starts now. In weight, 28 pounds is equal to how many stones? Two stones. Correct. What's the capital of the Spanish region of Catalonia? Barcelona. Correct. Rudolf Nureyev and Margot Fontaine made their names in which field of the arts? Ballet dancing. Correct. What musical features gangs called the Sharks and Jets? West Side Story. Correct. Who was elected Labour MP for Bolsover in 1970? Dennis Skinner. Correct. Evil Lynn, Teela and Skeletor were characters in what TV cartoon? Masters of the Universe. Yes, He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. The Edinburgh Festival Fringe starts in which month? August. Correct. In what decade did Marilyn Monroe die? The 60s. Correct. Who wrote the novel Train Spotting? Uh, Ian... No, Irving... Irvin Welsh. Correct. Uh, Pattaya and Koh Samui are holiday destinations in what country? Thailand. Correct. What US governmental department is concerned with foreign affairs? The... Past. State Department. What is ornithology the study of? Birds. Correct. Constantine II, who went into exile in 1967. Was... Correct. That is sensational. 12 questions, £12,000. Oh. Now you've got to try no, and hold on work. to it. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> you have one minute of quick fire questions. Every correct answer is worth £1,000. You've got okay. to build up as much money as you can. Ross, I wish you luck. Your time starts. Now, eaten as a delicacy, how is the roe of a sturgeon better known? Caviar. Correct. The North American striped is a species of what black and white mammal? Skunk. Correct. What character had adventures in one land and went through Alice. the looking glass? Correct. Cindy Crawford was married to which actor in the early 90s? Richard Gere. Correct. Which brothers played for England in the 66 World Cup final? Charlton's. Yes, correct. Michael Faraday and Karl Marx are buried in what London cemetery? Highgate. Correct. The climber George Mallory disappeared on which mountain in Everest. 1924? Correct. Who became King of Great Britain after the collapse of Cromwell's Commonwealth? Charles II. Correct. What does the Q stand for in the Australian airline Qantas? Queensland. Correct. Which late actor played Arnold in the US comedy Different Strokes? Coleman. Gary Yes, Coleman. I'll give you that. Known in Latin as Somnus, what's the Greek name for the god of sleep? Hypnos. Correct. Caesarion was the son of Julius Caesar and which queen of Egypt? Cleopatra. Correct. What sport is featured in the films Eight Men Out and Field of Dreams? Baseball. Correct. That's pretty extraordinary. 13 right. What a start for your team. Well done. Got to get over this first hurdle yet, Stu. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, here's correct answers worth a grand. I wish you luck. Thank you. Your time starts now. All children except one grow up is a line Peter from... Pan. Correct. In the air tonight was the first solo hit for which singer? Phil Collins. Correct. The Manchurian Crisis was a conflict between Japan and what country? China. Correct. In the 1990s, Mary Robinson was president of what country? Ireland. Correct. At World's End is the third part of what Hollywood film franchise? Pirates of the Caribbean. Correct. Archie Bunker was the American version of what British sitcom? I've it. Correct. Peter Carl were the first names of which Russian jeweller famous for his Easter eggs? Fabergé. Correct. What activity takes its name from the German for down and rope? Abseiling. Correct. On an electricity bill, what do the letters KWH stand for? Kilowatts per hour. Correct. In Edward Lear's poem, who danced by the light of the moon? Yellen Puskat. Correct. The church year begins with the first Sunday of what religious period? Lent. Advent. A hinny is the offspring of a female donkey and what? A male horse. Correct. In EastEnders, Wendy Richard played which member of the Fowlers? M Pauline. Correct. On a 10-pin bowling score sheet, what does extras represent? Oh, I tried Strike. to get it in for you. Yeah, it did very well. Not bad. 12 grand. 12? Yes. I'm very pleased. Oh, I should be impressed. Let's hope it rubs off today. Oh, let's hope so. Quick fire questions. Wish you luck. Your time starts now. The Black Mamba is an African variety of what reptile? Snake. Correct. What was football's FA Charity Shield renamed in 2002? The Community Shield. Correct. Julia Bradbury and Tim Vine were the first presenters of what TV channel? Channel 5. Correct. Prosecco is a sparkling wine originally from what European country? Italy. Correct. On a ship, what navigational aid is kept in a binnacle? The compass. Correct. Who wrote the travel books Down Under and A Walk in the Woods? Bill Bryson. Correct. In the animated film Hop, Russell Brand is the voice of what animal? 
kangaroo. Rabbit. Let's Twist Again was a 60s hit for which American singer? Chubby Checker. Correct. What island country is the title of a 2011 David Attenborough wildlife series? Madagascar. Correct. Frere is the French for what member of the family? Brother. Correct. Who played Sam Spade in the 41 film The Maltese Falcon? Humphrey Bogart. Correct. Legislation is the process of making or enacting what? Law. Correct. The National Museum of Wales is in what city? Cardiff. Correct. Which Chinese... What about that? 12,000. Thank you, Dalai. To his friends. Fantastic. <laughs> 12 grand. All we've got to do now, Stuart, is keep holding Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Quick fire against the clock, Mick. I wish you luck. Thank you. Your time starts now. In the film, what does Billy Elliot dream of becoming? Ballet dancer. Correct. In Keeping Up Appearances, what was the name of Hyacinth Bouquet's husband? Richard. Correct. The Mysterious Affair at Styles was which crime writer's first novel? Agatha Christie. Correct. Pearl on and cast on are terms used in what pastime? Knitting. Correct. Sweet Dreams Are Made of This was a hit for which duo? Eurythmics. Correct. What's the name of the lawman played by Kevin Costner in The Untouchables? Elliot Ness. Correct. Who managed England's 66 World Cup winning side? Pass. Sir Alf Ramsey. What you see is what you get is the autobiography of which businessman? Alan Sugar. Correct. What French phrase means the violent overthrow of a government? Coup d'etat. Yes, correct. The SAS drama Ultimate Force starred which former EastEnders actor? Ross Kemp. Correct. Disney's Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs was first shown in what decade? 30s. Correct. What Lerner and Lowe musical is based on Arthurian legend? Camelot. Correct. At the start of the nursery rhyme, Humpty Dumpty sat where? On a wall. Correct. What do you call the silky... That's extraordinary. That's oh, extraordinary. No. £12,000. Oh, yeah. £12,000, that was. Really well played. Thank you. <laughs>